What is going on everybody? Mattitude22 here today bringing you guys another figure review. Today we are looking at the Marvel Legends Walgreens exclusive Silver Surfer. I've been sitting on this guy for a while, not literally as he would be crushed into dust, but I'm very excited to finally be reviewing this guy. So checking out the packaging really quick. That Silver Surfer right across the front. And there's a Walgreens sticker. As they say in the pop community, it's all about the sticker. Uh, got Silver Surfer right there. It's kind of hard to see, but it says Silver Surfer right on the top. Actually, I didn't even get this at Walgreens. Uh, Canada doesn't have Walgreens. Got it at my local EB Games, and uh, it's got the sticker, so cool enough, right? There we go, Silver Surfer on the side. Nice shot of him, and I think it's the same shot on both sides. I had to do a double take there, like a triple take, but I think it is the same one. Nice shot of Silver Surfer on the back, and of course, a brief bio in four different languages. If you want to read that in any of these, then of course, feel free to pause this video now. Uh, no wave or other figures available because this is an exclusive, but pretty much got your barcodes and whatnot there, and there's, there's uh, some writing. There's how much I paid if you want to know. That's how much Legends cost here. But that is pretty much it for the packaging, guys. So let's just get right into the review. All right. So I'm just going to kind of go ahead and, and say it now. As much as I am happy to have a Silver Surfer, I know a lot of people are happy to have a Silver Surfer. This is very much a head-on-a-body figure. Um, there's really nothing to say. It's just a plain body all painted silver. Now, the silver paint is nice. It might be kind of hard to tell on camera, but it is kind of like chrome. So it is very nice. It is very shiny. Uh, the only concern, some of the joints are a little soft, like that's a little too easy to move. And I just feel like the more you articulate them, the more it's going to kind of chip away that nice kind of chromeness. Uh, we'll see if that happens. Face sculpt is good. I mean, it's a bald man. So, as far as bald man face sculpts go, that's a good one. Other than that, like I said, this is not going to be too in-depth because there's not really a lot to talk about. Aside from the paint, which is, I already mentioned, paint is spot on. Uh, aside from his articulation, I really don't have anything else to say about this guy. So, here we go, man. Head moves forward and back it does move side to side it is on a ball peg which is on a neck disc so we got that it's got the nice butterfly joints arm moves up to here about moves in this far of course see the butterfly joints themselves are really loose so i can't even articulate the shoulder because the butterfly joint is so is so loose uh, it, it just keeps kind of moving it so, I don't know about that. Uh, obviously, I prefer it than being stiff, but I, I just really worry about that kind of chrome paint. It's got a bicep swivel, double jointed elbow, wrist rotation, and wrist, wrist hinge, ab crunch. Hips move out this far. Well, I should say he has a waist twist, too. Kicks this far forward. And that far back, nice thigh swivel, double jointed knee, he's even got a boot swivel on there, so we, it's kind of nice. And then he has ankle, ankle pivot and ankle rockers. So like I said, standard articulation, nothing new and exciting here. Uh, and as far as sculpt goes, there's really... There's really nothing to there's really nothing to speak of in terms of sculpt. Like I said, it is a head on a body figure, which don't get me wrong. All in all, I'm still very, very happy to uh finally have a silver surfer. Alright. Accessories. He, he comes with alternate hands, so you got the flying hands. Focus. Focus. There you go. He comes with obviously a fist, so I do have the left fist and there is the right fist and the left kind of open hands it comes with that so three sets of hands in total no alternate heads which 
I, I mean, I guess you tell me if that's good or bad. Uh, I think maybe they could have thrown in an extra facial expression, but it is what it is. Uh, it comes with these blast effects, which we have seen time and time again. Nothing new or original here. I can't even name how many characters have had these effects. But um, these ones are kind of a nice translucent yellow plastic, so they do look nice, I guess. It is to reminisce the, their reminisce. To represent the power cosmic. Uh, so yeah, pretty nice, but uh, these really don't impress me when you've seen them so much. And he is Silver Surfer, so he definitely comes with a surfboard. Uh, so you can see there's a peg there. You just peg his foot onto it. It looks nice, not so much on the bottom, but it is kind of a nice kind of chrome. It's, so it's got kind of like a nice shine to it. Looks good. Got the lines going across. Uh, it is definitely a good, a, a good length for him, I think. You know, it's not too short, but it's not too, too tall. The only thing with the one foot that pegs in, it doesn't always, he doesn't always stay on the board as well as I would like. But you can kind of, kind of whip something together. I maybe, I maybe unless you're gonna kind of find a way to tie his other foot down. I don't know if I would hang this guy because I feel like he's gonna fall off the board quite often because he doesn't. Because it's just got the one foot pegged in. But I could be wrong about that. Overall, guys, really like this figure. Really, really solid figure. If you're just kind of casually into Legends or if you're not doing the Build-A-Figure thing, then this is a great one to just kind of pick up and just be like, hey, I have a Silver Surfer. Really good figure. Really nice. Don't expect too much because you're not going to get too much in terms of sculpting, but if you just kind of want to beef up that cosmic shelf and you kind of want to have uh, that kind of extra touch then get a silver surfer man uh all in all i don't even know what i'm i don't even know what i'm talking about anymore guys but uh i'm just i'm, <laughs> I'm just gonna end it here because i'm just i'm just rambling on now you guys don't want to hear me ramble but uh thank you again for watching really appreciate all the support guys but please make sure you like share comment and subscribe i would really really appreciate that if you want to hit that notification bell and that way you never miss anything, please feel free to do that. That would also help me out. As always, guys, social media links are going to be in the description. Of course, facebook.com slash sanctuary. Head over there. Tell them this video sent you. Other than that, I think that's pretty much it, guys. So you've heard me. You've bared with me rambling on long enough. Thank you very much. Have yourselves a great day, and I will catch you next time with another figure review. And bye.